Dr. Crocker Pet Vet here. If you guys like videos with cool cases, uh, talking about animals, learning about stuff in veterinary medicine, make sure to subscribe, make sure to like and share these videos. I wanna grow this account. I wanna show you what a day in the life of a veterinarian is because I love my job and it's really cool. Thanks for watching. Hey guys, I'm here at the emergency clinic today and I have a cool case for you. I have a four month old cat who presented for foreign body ingestion. Now the kitten ate a needle and the reason we know this is because the owners were doing something with needle and thread and the thread is actually hanging out of the mouth with some beads on the end of it and the needle is nowhere to be found. So we're gonna take some x-rays and see what we find on the x-ray and see what we can do for the cat. All right, so we took our x-ray and the cat definitely ingested the needle. And on the x-ray, the needle has actually migrated out of the stomach and is sitting horizontal. It looks like freely in the abdomen. And surgery is not an option for this patient due to financial constraints. And so I did note that the needle was poking just through the side of the body wall. Um, and on second look, I could feel it on palpation. So the plan is going to be, light sedation and see if we can lidocaine over the area and actually pull the needle out from the side of the body wall um, and remove it that way without having to take this patient to surgery again it's not really an option so if we can't fix this cat unfortunately euthanasia would be the only option so wish us luck Great news, we successfully removed the needle out the side of the body wall and then out the mouth. Once we had cut the needle off, we were able to pull the string out. This cat is gonna go home on pain meds, antibiotics, and I really expect it to do well. Cats do great, they heal well. We're gonna to try to do a follow-up on it, but again, this is the ER, so it's hard to say, but he woke up well, he was happy, and fingers crossed, he continues to heal up. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share if you want more videos like this, and have a great day.